Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Unmask Your Beauty series brought to you by Adoya Beauty TV and in this episode I will be sharing two ways to handle failure. As we all know, failure is, is part of life. You know, there are times you really want to do something, you try so hard, you work so hard and you do these things and you know, things, you just don't get the right result, the results that you want, you know, is not accomplished and you're like, oh, what's happening? You know, most times it drains our energy, most times we, uh, we're sad, you know, different things happen and um, it is just part of life. So um, today I would share two things, two ways to handle failure. And number one is see failure as feedback. Now, I'll give you a very good story. So when I was starting my business here in Calgary, I wanted to collaborate with, a, with another company to, you know, to roll out a project. And I got so excited, I was so happy. I had posted about it on social media and, you know, there was so much rave about it. And all of a sudden, you know, the other company just, you know, stopped the project and we just couldn't move on again and you know i felt really bad my energy was low and i was like oh why did i even put my name in all of this now people won't trust my brand now you know i started thinking of so many things but you know what it taught me a lot of lessons and number one is I shouldn't just put my name just with you know with just any brand all in the name of collaboration i should make sure the papers are signed everything is done legally before putting anything out you know it took me so many other lessons but that's just one of them so see failure as feedback and when i thought of it that way i'm like i will never make this mistake again thank god it is happening now so if you actually see it that way then Failure is a good thing, right? <laughs> then number two is see failure as the beginning of a new thing. So see failure, uh, it's, it's not the end of the world. It's like something is ending and you're entering another phase. So I'll give that same example. So when that happened, I felt really bad. I was like, okay, so where does my company go? This was, you know, a good sales channel for my company. And it's, you know, it thought it seemed like a very good idea. So where do I go? And I started to, you know, come up with other ideas that I started working on. And they turned out to be even more successful than what I thought. So, um, so two things I've talked about today is see failure as feedback and number two is see failure as the beginning of something new. You know, it's the end, you've, you've ended something that didn't work, which you've gotten feedback from, and then you're starting something new and you're a stronger person. You have learned, you've learned something. You're stronger from that experience. So over to you what you're gonna tell me one thing that you have failed at recently and tell me what you did to handle that situation the best conversations happen on the website adonia.com go to the blog under this video and this blog post write exactly one one thing you have failed at recently and how exactly you handled it remember you are strong you are beautiful you are a woman you are enough and you're powerful beyond measure. So go out there and unmask your beauty.